Okay, we got UFC Conor McGregor versus Khabib Nurmer something Eastern European. And of course we know Conor McGregor being cocky as all get out as he usually is. You know, in the press conference uh, he's all mouth because he he went toe to toe with Floyd Mayweather which is a great accomplishment but so did Manny Pacquiao so did a bunch of other people but that's getting off subject but Conor McGregor with his uh, Irish you know who the fuck with the king who the fuck are you talking to ah oh, I'm Conor McGregor for a class sick we know who you are, man. We know exactly who you are. You're a cocky little Irish joker who is more than likely going to get his ass whipped by the modern day. Well, I guess the, the modern day uh, Ivan Drago. Except uh, he's not Dolph Lundgren and this ain't Rocky. B likes to come out to his matches wearing those uh off the wall type wigs which is and that's pretty neat. It's see it's nice to see somebody come out there to uh do their thing and have fun while they're doing it. Knowing they're going to beat ass anyways. Him being twenty six and O, he come out there wearing a bikini for all I care as long as he's gonna beat somebody beat somebody. With Khabib and Connor's striking abilities, I believe Khabib will try to take Connor to the ground early in the fight. Granted, uh, if you don't beat his face in for what Connor said about his dad and his brother, it's going to be a smash fest, to say the least. In all honesty, uh, I think they said Connor's been out of the octagon for well, almost two years. So, with him trying to come back, it's going to be it's touted as the fight of the century, MMA wise. That's almost like uh, Hulk Hogan versus Andre the Giant way back in the day when wrestling was actually wrestling. With Khabib's 26-0 record and Conor McGregor's 21-3 record, I do believe that it's going to be a fight to watch. Whether it's going to be streamed here on, on, face, on Facebook or YouTube or wherever, it's going to be a highly anticipated fight for October the 6th. And it's, uh, as you can see, they'll just be talking about it. It's got my youngest boy excited. He's happy about it. He don't, he don't know what it is, but he wants to holler. So, yeah, it's going to be... In the words of uh, in the words of uh, Jim Ross, a slobber knocker, throwing up wrestling again because those guys wrestle. I know it's uh, not that type of wrestling, but it's wrestling. So uh, lots of ground games, striking, striking, grappling, ground to pound, you name it, it's going to happen. So, guys, your thoughts. Who do you think is going to take this? Conor McGregor or Khabib Nurmagomedov? I think I got it. Uh, I've been reading up on it on a lot of uh, MMA fighters, past and present, and it's uh, pretty much, I don't, I don't want to say it's uh, a tie. So to speak, but it's pretty much <laughs> I think it's pretty much gonna it's pretty much one sided. It's gonna be uh Khabib by TKO in the first round. I just think that he's got that kind of power. And he's just gonna catch McGregor off guard and he's gonna hit him with something that McGregor that Connor's never seen. 
And that's the one you, the ones, that's the ones that get you. The punches you don't see coming are the ones that hurt you the most. I learned that in boxing. The hard way. So, comment below who you think is going to take this. Khabib, McGregor. Let's get a debate going. Everybody, come together. Let's go. Let's get it going. October 6th, pay-per-view. I believe it's in Chicago. I'm not too sure. I have to look it up again to make sure. But, let's do it. Let's go Khabib.